Welcome back to the channel guys. Today's a big day. Uh, big truck, big lift kit, big deal. I've been working on this one for a long time. This has been about a year, maybe a year and a half in the, in the making. We've been trying to perfect the build and get the right parts ordered for them. We've gone back and forth on wheels. We've gone back and forth on lift kits, but today is install day and it's dropped off a day early too. So it's a 2021 uh, Silverado 1500. This one's gonna get a nine inch FTS with uh, some white color matching spots on a black lift kit. It's gonna get some all black KG1 Forge 26 by 14s and some 37, 1450, 26 Furies. All the way from Miami, Florida, he brings me a color match white Silverado with a 6.2 in it. Uh, he drove all night long to be here last night to get this lift kit put on and he just took off back to Miami. Uh, Alex, so that wide bow tie, he is driving this truck back this weekend to Miami and flying back. We're supplying all the parts that are going on the truck except for the tires. He got a little bit of a better deal somewhere, I guess, uh, or he had some rewards points or something on a credit card, but we've got a set of 37, 14, 50 Fury 26. I'm sorry, 37, 14, 50, 26 Fury MTs right here. Going to set nice and square on that 26 by 14 wheel. Uh, that nine inch FTS lift kit in all black with the white accents is going to be absolutely awesome match with this truck. The upper control arms will have white on them and then the front cross member will have a white backing plate. I'll get to that in a little bit later so you can see it, but this one's going to be great. Appreciate it. Appreciate you watching. White uh, Silverado is halfway done and it's not scheduled until today. So they got to jump uh, start on it yesterday afternoon 
and we're getting really close to being done. Um, you guys see me do a lot of McGoys on the channel, but you don't see as many FTSs. FTS is just as good of a lift kit in my opinion. It's just a custom lift kit. So it's not like you can just buy one off the shelf. When you want an FTS, you pretty much get you can get a black basic kit, but there's a lot of accessories and colors and different upgrades you can do for it. So it's a little bit more personal. I'm going to show you the difference uh, between the kits on the truck. They're really about the same as far as what they do, but they look different. So you have your FTS upper control arm right here. Uh, does the same, you know, angle correction that the McGoys does, but it looks a little different. Gets you a customized FTS badge right there. This one's a little dirty, but it's white, like same color as the truck. And then on the front cross member, it's not installed yet, but we'll be doing a black backing plate right there to see uh, the color contrast. So anyway, it's dark in here right now and kind of quiet. So that's why I'm in here. But in a, in a few minutes, the lights will come on and I'll show you the cross member with the backing plate in it. I feel like this week we're going back to the 2021-2022 uh, vibes. These uh, older face Silverados, man, it's bringing back some good memories. This is a nine inch FTS lift kit, 26 by 14 KG1 Vortexes in gloss black and 37 1450 26 Fury MTs. It never really gets old. I know we do a lot of these, um, but man, this thing looks awesome. This is for my boy William from uh, Miami, Florida. He drove it up last week and dropped it off with us to get it done and it's taken about two to three days. We're almost done with the truck. He pretty much bought every accessory that we offer, so that's why it took a couple more, you know, a couple days versus just one day. This uh, truck is gonna be driven back to Miami this weekend by Alex. And uh, I think it turned out awesome. One cool thing we did on this one, we did the uh, infinite off-road rock lights and wheel lights. 
He upgraded the rock light to their 24 watt, which is a lot brighter than the 12 watt, but it's a lot bigger and bulkier looking. So sometimes, you know, people like that. Sometimes they don't really looks cool on this one. Uh, we did their quadro led lights on the wheels. Very, very sharp it goes, uh, any color you want. I personally like them, you know, white, but it's set on white now, but it'll go any color. The FTS cross member, perfect as usual. Gloss black with the white backing plate in the background. Looks really, really cool on the truck. We did uh, also a set of the Amp Research Power Steps. If you guys uh, haven't seen these before, it makes owning a lifted truck very, very easy. As soon as you open the door, they open up. Nice, sturdy step to put your foot on and get up in the truck. Very, very easy and seamless. Overall, I think it turned out very nice. One special thing about this RST is it has the uh, 6.2 in it. Not the most common motor to see in these trucks, but it's definitely the most powerful one. Let me know what you think.